The completely realistic video that you're seeing on screen now is actually 100% fake. You simply type out an instruction like this and the AI generates that video from scratch in minutes. No video cameras or VFX artists needed. These AI videos got me thinking about YouTube Shorts. I wondered when Sora gets released to the public soon, will there be another AI that YouTubers can use to quickly turn their Sora videos into YouTube Shorts just like this? Turns out there is. And here's a quick preview of what one of the shorts I made using it looks and sounds like. Ever feel like you're running on autopilot? Remember, even a robot is programmed to evolve and improve. So let's take a cue from our mechanical friends. Embrace change, strive for progress, and remember, you're built to overcome any challenge. So in this video, I'll show you how to bulk create motivation shorts like you've just seen from Sora in minutes using that tool. Great, so we're looking at the tool that we're going to use to make these motivation YouTube shorts. You'll see up here that it's called Wondershare Uni Converter. There'll be a link in the description to this video for you to download this yourself. And we're going to jump into auto crop down here to get started. So let's click that. And as you can see, this video of the robot made from Sora that's playing is a wide video. It's horizontal, which suggests that Sora is only going to generate horizontal videos for us, at least when it launches. And the problem here is YouTube Shorts, TikToks, Instagram Reels, they are all vertical videos in the 9 by 16 resolution, not the 16 by 9 resolution that you're currently watching me on. So in order to bulk create YouTube Shorts from our horizontal Sora videos, we're going to need a way to quickly turn them into vertical videos in the shape that this rectangle is here in the auto crop tool. And this auto crop tool makes it really easy by choosing Instagram and then choosing the story reels preset. I can press analyze and the tool is going to scan through that original Sora video, find the interesting subjects and convert it to a vertical video that always keeps the interesting subjects inside that new crop. As we can see here, the auto crop tool has now finished the analysis and it attempted to crop the video and keep the point of interest, so in this case the robot, in the frame for the whole time. There's a few moments where it messes up, like here where it's lost the robot. And what we can do to fix that is we can bring the video back to just before the auto framing messed up. So there, set a keyframe at this correct moment and then scan forwards to the end of the moment where the auto framing made the mistake. Bring the second keyframe to that point, drag the framing to where the video should be looking at. And if we press play again at that time, we'll see that the framing stays locked on what we want the video to be looking at. Great, and after those few tiny touches, we now have the original video analyzed with vertical framing, making sure the robot is kept in the shot at all times throughout the whole 20 seconds. And we can now press this export button down here to save our new horizontal nine by 16 version of our Sora video, which is the first stage of turning these Sora videos into motivational shorts. So let's save that now. Great, so next, you might remember that that motivational short at the start had a voiceover on top of it. Here's a little reminder. Ever feel like you're running on autopilot? So in order to make a voiceover for our shorts, we'll first need a script so that we know what the voiceover's going to say. So let me show you how to use the tool to get that to. So we're back on Wondershare Uniconverter's main dashboard and we're going to click on AI script generator to create this script for us. Let's give that a click. So if we look here, we get to choose what tone our script is. As we're making a motivational short, we're going to say instructive as we're giving people motivational advice. Looking at the video type up here, we'll say educational. And when we look at video platform we're generating for, I found it best to click Instagram Reels, as Instagram Reels are always short, whereas a YouTube video could be five, 10 minutes long, and we don't want a super long script like that. So let's select Instagram Reels. And here, I'm just going to type, create me a 15 second long motivational paragraph that references a robot whilst providing motivation to the viewer. I want the script to mention a robot because there's a robot in the video we made from Sora, you just change this to whatever is in the video that you've made from Sora originally. 
Then we just press generate. And in a couple of seconds, we're given this. Ever feel like you're running on autopilot? Remember, even a robot is programmed to evolve and improve. So let's take a cue from our mechanical friends, embrace change, strive for progress, and remember, you're built to overcome any challenge. That sounds ideal, if you ask me. It also references the robot that's going to be showing in the video perfectly. What this feature basically means is, whenever we come up with a new idea for a Sora video, we're going to be able to come up with what will be said on top of that video in just seconds over and over again, allowing us to think about bulk creating shorts in a way that we never could before. So I think this is amazing. Great, so let's copy that script that we've just had instantly generated. And next we need a voiceover. So for the voiceover here, traditionally, we need to get our microphone set up and sit and record a voiceover for every new short idea that we come up with. I found a way to generate voiceovers inside this tool too, saving us a ton of time, not having to record our own voice. Here is how we do that. We need to head to text to speech AI in the AI lab, paste our scripts in this box here, choose a voice to say it. I found that I like this deep voice here the best. And then we simply press generate and in a couple of seconds, we get this. Ever feel like you're running on autopilot? Remember, even a robot is programmed to evolve and improve. So let's take a cue from our mechanical friends. Embrace change, strive for progress, and remember, you're built to overcome any challenge. Incredible. We've just come up with a creative script and a voice saying that script for our short in about 30 seconds in total. And now we just need to export this voiceover to the same location where the horizontal auto cropped video was and we're most of the way there. Great, so I've just quickly combined that voiceover with the horizontal video in editing software. I use Premiere, you can use whatever you want. But what we really need now, if you look at the short that was shown at the start of the video, are those text captions popping up on screen as the voiceover is talking. And ask me why, but captions showing on screen are the standard with shorts. If they're not in your short, it's less likely to succeed. So we need those captions there. Great. So to get those captions added to our short, we need to go to this AI tool down here now, the subtitle editor. So let's click that. I've added the horizontal video with the voiceover to the tool here. I just press play to show you. Ever feel like you're running on autopilot? Cool. And now we need to generate those captions to go on at this video. So to do that quickly and easy, I found that we can just press this button here, the auto subtitle generator. I'm going to leave that on the English United States language settings and press start now to transcribe that voiceover into text. It's just going to take a few seconds to do that. Great. And pretty quickly that's done. And it saved those captions in a text document on my computer. So I can just press OK now. And automatically, if we now scroll through the video, we can see that it's instantly had those captions added to it to match what the voiceover is saying. Now, I don't like how these captions are looking. I don't like the design. So I'm going to make some changes here. I'm just going to jump into styles. So first, I want this text in the middle of the screen. So I'm going to change the position here to the middle. I feel like a black line around the words will make it easier to read, make it pop out more. So I'm going to change the outline width to eight. And I think I'll make the text slightly bigger. Let's go up to 33. Awesome. I like that. So now as I want these subtitle design changes to be applied to every single instance that there's text on screen, I'm going to click on the subtitles that I've changed, scroll down to the bottom, press apply to all. Yes. And if we scroll through now, we'll see that we have instantly added text to our video in seconds. Something that just a few months ago wouldn't have been possible. This amazing auto caption technology is something I've only really seen popping up in the space in the last few months. I think it's amazing because it used to take so long to add this text to our shorts and now we can do it in a click of a button. Then we simply click this button down here to save our new motivational YouTube short made from Sora and now looking exactly like the short that you saw at the start of the video. I hope this video has started to show you some of AI's possibilities it gives us in creating, editing and repurposing our videos and also giving you a glimpse of what we can expect more of in the future.
There's tons of other useful bonus features inside Beauty Converter we can use to help us with making video content. We've got this intro and outro adder where you can mass select videos on your computer and then use these buttons over here to add clips to the start and the end of each of those videos in bulk. You've also got the AI video enhancer tool here where you can quickly use these buttons to remove any noise and distortion from the image or to add a ton more frames into the original video to make it a lot smoother if it's a choppy video originally. So there's already a ton of AI tools out there to help us with video creation, and that's just gonna grow more and more in the future. You can grab Wondershare Uniconverter, that's the tool I use in this video to turn those AI-generated Sora videos into shorts. You can grab that tool by following the link in the description to this video. And I urge you to start looking into how you can use AI tools to make your life easier. If you wanna know where to start, here's a playlist I've been putting together for tools video creators can use to make their videos quicker and just make much more beautiful looking videos so you give that playlist a watch next and remember to subscribe to the channel bye